New at five with the passing of one of the last known survivors of the Tulsa race massacre in 1921. There's a great push now in preserving that part of history. Two works for you reporter Jitzel Puente talked to the Greenwood Cultural Center today about the impact Olivia Hooker's death has in the community. It transitions us into a new period where we no longer have any living survivors of the massacre. Michelle Brown is trying to fight back tears as she talks about Dr. Olivia Hooker's passing. Although she didn't personally know her, she knows what Dr. Hooker stood for all these years. She was an advocate for telling our history. She was one of the most vocal survivors that we had. Dr. Hooker was one of the last known survivors of the Tulsa Race Massacre, where as many as 300 black people died in 1921. We still meet people almost every day that visit the Greenwood Cultural Center and say, I never heard about this. You know, I didn't learn about this until a few years ago. That's where the Greenwood Cultural Center in downtown Tulsa comes into play, trying to educate the public of the violent part of history that sometimes remains untold. The center is currently working to expand and provide a more interactive experience with visitors. They want new exhibits to appeal to a younger audience leading up to the massacre centennial. This isn't just black history. This is a part of our nation's history, and it's important for everyone to know, to be aware of, to be informed about. Reporting in Tulsa, Jitzel Puente, Two Works for You.